Now, Colombian judge has startled people by admitting that he used the artificial intelligence tool ChatGPT to aid his decision making when deciding whether an autistic child's insurance should cover all of the course of medical treatment. Judge Juan Manuel Padilla concluded that the entirety of the child's medical expenses and transport costs should be paid by his medical plan. However, the ruling was not an issue. The conversation Judge Padilla had with ChatGPT while making the decision created a stir. How ChatGPT works is to generate informed responses is that it scores the internet and provides different answers to the same question. But on occasion, it also fabricates information and delivers in inventive and compelling lies. The legal documents show that the judge asking Chad GPT the precise legal matter at hand, and I'm quoting here, is an autistic minor exonerated from paying fees for their therapies? And Chad GPT's response corresponded with the judge's judge's final decision, yes, this is correct. According to the regulations in Colombia, minors diagnosed with autism are exempt from paying fees for their therapies. When this became public, it gave rise to a discussion about the use of artificial intelligence and Padilla's peers criticized his move. However, the judge defended his actions by suggesting that this could help the bloated legal system of Colombia, that the aim was to bring efficiency and improve response times rather than aiming to replace judges altogether.